Hello everybody, this is Theron. Welcome to Minecraft Land Party. Minecraft, Java Edition, loved by millions. Minecraft 1.14.4. And there's the Minecraft Land Party server. 1.14.4. Let's see how this goes. So, how are you? I'm doing okay. Um, oh, there's somebody down there, isn't there? Oh, a little short. Bam. Okay, so, we are on the Man Minecraft Land Party server. And listen to the beacon sound. Nice. Uh, sun's going down. I uh, could have started at a more... Uh, convenient time, but let's see what we got. I have to go sleep here, and then we'll go out into the world and explore a little bit. I've got all my stuff prepared. I've got a full set of rockets, and okay, sun's almost down. Sun's almost down. There we go. First sleep on the on the new version. There we go. All right, so let's go. Let's go take a look. We already tested most of the stuff on the test server, so I have a feeling things are going to be okay. Uh, stuff I didn't really look at. Let's let's go out and visit the uh, aquarium and the labyrinth. Seems to be where Bar makes things is working most of the time now. Um, so let's. Get some altitude here. I am on the old keyboard. There we go. Um, the older keyboard, uh, because the new one I like it, but it doesn't uh, doesn't necessarily fit. Oh, you know what? Flying around to check out stuff might not be the smartest idea, because it's got to convert all these chunks. I'm probably overloading the server a little bit right now. So we'll have to be a little careful, cautious, careful, whatever the first, the first time into any new area. Um, well, it, but I don't think the chunk conversion is as uh, extensive as it was going to 1.13. They changed the chunk format. Um, so I might be a little lost here. Wait, out of the jungle. Or jungle. Oh, there's the labyrinth. Okay. I know where I am. Uh, oh, one thing I was talking with Barb makes things about the glass here. The glass, she was hoping the glass would be a little bit more transparent. And it is. There's less of the little highlight lines in the way. It's not too bad. Um, but we wanted to see what... Put some of... She put some of the light blue and yellow glass up so we could see what it looked like. Oh, I like the light blue. It's nice looking. Uh, so I may have to help replace some of the glass because I kind of I kind of offered. That was my my uh, my idea. So I kind of Ow! I didn't fly at all. Ow! That was a little painful. So the question was, from down inside the labyrinth, what looks better? The clear glass, the new clear glass texture is nicer, definitely, so it'd probably be fine. But this, to me, it just, it blends in with the sky a little bit. So, I don't know. We will see, and... Make a decision. And I will help replace all this glass with light blue glass, if that is the the plan. There's a village over here. Oh, 
I did not know there was a village over here. Oh, and it's a goofy one. Built into the side of a hill, so some of it's way up here, and the rest of it's way down there. And, oh, there's a poor squid. Hmm. Okay, so I would not expect, see, like, there's a weird house here. Would not expect anyone to get into this weird house. No. Uh, I would not expect there to be any uh, illager structures. Somebody's trying to get out. Where's the door? Is there a door over here? No. Aw. Oh. You're trapped in there, aren't you? Okay. I wouldn't expect there to be any illager structures anywhere nearby because they're generated. Um, so yeah, and the aquarium is over here, or am I completely turned around and lost? I might be completely turned around and lost. Hmm. Oh no, this is the backside, so the aquarium is probably over there. Alright, because standing at the front here, it was looking over this direction, I think, to see it. Is it in the water over here? By the mesa? Desert? I don't know. I've lost the aquarium. Oh, there it is. Okay. Look at all the fishies. Okay, there is a portal down here, so let's let's go into the portal and Wow. So the glass texture is now clear enough, it's actually difficult to tell where uh where the water is and where the glass is. I mean it's not impossible, you can see it, but Okay, uh, portal over there. Let's go. Uh, let's go somewhere. So, the two areas of biggest concern are in the in the pyramid. Got a bunch of villagers that are probably no longer employed. So let's go over to the pyramid. And, oh, we can peek in on the nether fortress and see if stuff is spawning there and see if we can get ourselves another uh, wither skull. Oh, hello. And... So I separated out. I, I brought over another villager into the pyramid. Turns out I I didn't. I already had ten. I didn't need another one. But I've got eleven brown coats, which two of them are farmers, and I traded with them, so they should still be farmers. Uh, the other uh, nine may need a little bit of convincing that they are villagers, so they may be unemployed at the moment. There's nobody in here, huh? So, let's get out to the pyramid, take a look at what the situation is there, see if we can convince some of them that they are villagers and trade with them to sort of make them stick. And then uh, we can start building the... Oh, the cactus looks different. 
interesting. Uh, start building out the uh, carrot farm and then see how many of the potato farmers no longer think they're potato farmers. Okay, welcome to the pyramid. And uh, I already checked a lot of this stuff. The slime farm still, still should work. Um, the squid farm is dead, but that's okay. Ah, see, slime's still spawning and falling and bashing themselves against some cactus, trying to get at the iron golems. One of the cool things in one of the 1.15 updates is you can actually now repair iron golems. It's kind of cool. All right. Hello, guys. Okay, so these guys are set aside. They are farmers. Hello, buddy. Yes, he's a farmer, and he's a farmer, and he's unemployed. He's a fisherman. Hmm. Another fisherman. Another fisherman. So the fisherman might be a problem. It's okay. We'll deal with that. So I've got in here, I've got... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then I have another another brown coat over here. So these two guys I brought over essentially to be a breeder, but they, it's not necessary anymore. I could convert them into something. Um, and this guy is also wearing a little fisherman cap. So I think he's a fisherman too. Fisherman. Now question is if I give him a workstation will he convert because I've never traded anything with him I just pulled him out so could he be a fisherman just because he doesn't see a workstation around so let's uh let's figure out I should have done this already but let's figure out how to build a composter so the composter is a simple recipe for bedrock but they for some reason had to make it complicated for Java Edition. Let's see if I got the pieces I need to make it. Otherwise, I'll need to get some wood. I just need some planks and stuff. Um, I need fence posts and I need I need uh, wood planks. Okay. So this is when we go to my old construction chests that I really need to get rid of and see if I happen to have anything useful in any of them. Not here. And let's go over here. I know what's in those and they will not help. Uh, here's one plank, wood plank. I need two more plus fence gates or fences. Um, huh. What's in these? These are empty shulker boxes. Uh, some carrots would be helpful to trade with, with one of them to make sure that they stay a farmer. Come on. There we go. Thank you. Um, uh, okay, I'm not going to be there. Okay, so I will need to go... Okay, give me... Yeah. Give me a sec. Okay. Uh, fences. I need fences. And then from the fences... Oh, new recipes. I can make a composter. Or two. I actually need a bunch. So let's go ahead and make a bunch of composters. Okay, I have not played with this block at all yet. Uh, I cut down my tree, my... Uh, farming tree replanted and chopped a bunch of the blocks uh, with my silk touch axe because I want uh, I want some stuff to put into the composter okay so this guy needs to be able to see the composter right Eat. do I have my yeah I do okay um Hey dude, how's it going? I'm gonna put a composter in, in the center here for you. And we'll just do it right here. Let's get a, we'll go plop. And then I will put a composter right here, plop. You can now see the composter. Huh. 
Maybe when they convert, they get stuck. Huh. Huh. Fisherman, I don't want you to be a fisherman. Okay, while I'm waiting for him to decide, he can be a farmer. Maybe he won't. Um, so you can put these. Very inefficient way to get bone meal. Very exciting. Huh. Okay, I'll leave you to it for a bit. I have some carrots. Can we convince one of these guys he's a farmer? Because I have enough composters. These guys. So some of these guys are unemployed. Huh. These guys are bona fide farmers. Uh, that guy's a fisherman. Can I put this down? No. Do I need to let you out of the boat? Do you need to be able to pathfind to it? Huh. Oh wait. Fisherman. Oh, you're a farmer. Let me trade some, uh, I don't have potatoes on me. Let me go get some potatoes. Uh, potatoes, I got a bunch over here. I mean, I have a bunch over there in the farm, but. Potatoes and carrots. Oh, look. I've got new recipes. I know how to make potatoes. Bake potatoes now. All right. So that guy, if I trade with him, he will stick being a farmer. Hi, dude. Yeah, yeah. Let me give you some uh, potatoes. We'll do, uh, we'll do that. Huh. Huh? Oh, interesting. So I need... Oh, it shows you how much they will grow. You can't just do the one. Interesting. I probably don't need to trade all this with him. But, um, okay. Any of you... Any of you want to become a farmer? Get in this boat here. Ugh. Oops. Let's get out of the boat. Okay. So I'm collecting actual farmers over here. And if some of these guys are kind of stuck where they were, I might have a bit of a problem. But, let's see what we can do. Oh, wait. Oh, you're a farmer now. But you want beets. I don't have any beets at all. But I can buy some bread off of you. Okay, now you grew up a little bit. Okay, that's fine. Let's put you over here. I don't care that you want beetroot because I'm not using you to trade at all. So now I got four bona fide farmers. Let's put another composter down. Oh, hello. You finally, you want potatoes. Let me trade some potatoes with you. Okay. 
thank you. You are now a farmer. Okay, so this is, uh, this might get a little tedious. I may have to build a, a villager breeder. Uh, but the nice thing is I can do it in the, in the temple, in the, in the pyramid here. Um, so I need the two more. Okay. Oh, you just, you just changed. You want wheat. I don't have any wheat. Um, where can I get wheat? <laughs> I wasn't planning on having any wheat. Okay. All right, I may leave this for the time being. Did he change? No, he's still a, he's still a fisher guy. Hmm. Do I have some wheat up there? It looks like I do. Let's go collect some wheat. How do I get up here? Did I put ladders in? Why didn't I put ladders in? Huh. Do I have any wheat in this chest? No. I don't need all that. Okay. So if I put, uh, I can put a block of leaves down here and then I can, wait, these are, so touch, I have fortune here. Oh, that's right. That won't actually get me any more wheat. It'll just get me more seeds. Okay, so the seeds, oh, that's a ton of seeds. Uh, replant. Oh, whoops. Okay, uh, that's a fine. So let's go, I have 14 wheat. That should be enough to trade with one once. Huh. Hi. No, it's not. I need 20. Okay. Get some more wheat. I do have more here. I have 28. Which is enough. <clears throat> so my goal here is I need 10 farmers. You're now a farmer. Um, it's, uh... Oops. Oh, wow. I don't even remember what that sign said at this point. Oh. Put you over here. And... Need to read up on the rules of farmer breeding. Okay, so... My composters here and give you one, oops, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then I've got. Oh, you're a farmer. Put you there. Uh, farmer, you want potatoes? I'll take potatoes. Take lots of potatoes. Oh. He unlocked. Huh? huh? Now he, he'll take more stuff now. Uh-huh. Takes a lot more trades to get him to level up the next time. And, uh... Take some apples. Uh... 
Oh. Oh. Let's put them over here with these guys. Now I have seven bonafide farmers. And uh, put down a workstation for you there. Okay, so I have three guys here who are fisher people. And I don't want them to be anymore, but I don't know if I can get them to convert the way I want. So we'll just we'll put down a few here just in case they decide to. Let's quickly go look at the uh, potato guys and see, see how many of them are still potato guys. Look at, I've got lots of potatoes. Okay. All right. So, question is, how many of these are still potato farmers, or farmers in general? Um, and then I need to give them. I don't know if I need to, but so he's a farmer. Um, let's see here. Do I? So my my. Oops. Ah. Shoot. That was bad. So my plan was to... Because he comes here and he, he digs up stuff. And he tries to plant. Oops. Okay. Uh, and he tries to plant here and... And this is my plan. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Huh. Hi. We have a small problem. Oh, maybe I can just do that. So, my plan was to give him a workstation so that he would remain a farmer. Because he is a farmer, and he wants... Do I, I have enough potatoes? Let's trade with him just to make sure he stays a farmer. I don't know that he needs to be able to re, uh, restock his trades, because I'm not going to be in here trading with them. Okay, so... Oh, that was just the bottom guy. And then this one here... Where is he? Hi, you're unemployed. So let me do this. Blop! Hi, you're now a farmer. Excellent. Okay, that... That is, uh... Uh-huh. That's, that's good. I'm happy that that's two out of the ten. So 20%. Uh, okay, so we'll need to do this. He's a farmer. I wonder, was I being careful about only moving farmers over here? That would be smart. Oh, I did not mean to hit you. Oh, and I've traded with you. You know what? I'm going to trade with you a lot because I want you to feel better. See, so he's running away from me. Huh? Uh, what else does he have? I can give him one of these and get uh, an apple. Blop. I don't need that many apples. I can buy myself some tasty pumpkin pie. He just healed up a little bit. That's good. I can buy some more bread off of him. Um, yeah. Okay. 
You feeling better, dude? I did not mean to hit you. I apologize. All right. Oops, no. Oh. Did I go the wrong way? No. Oh, and time of day is important now, isn't it? These guys won't even... Uh... Let me get some more pumpkin pie. At least that stacks. These guys won't even farm unless it's at the right time of day. Which will cut down the productivity of the farm somewhat, but... Because it will only work when they're actually... Uh, yeah, that'll work. Hi! Would you like a profession? Ha! Ah, thank you. This is working. Um, let's get some more bread, I guess. Thank you. Ah, they're in. All right. Well, I have some yellow glass around here somewhere that I can... Uh, hi. Would you like a profession? Ah. Uh, it's working quite well with these guys. I don't have enough wheat. Okay. Okay, well, he, sh he has the workstation, so in theory he should remain a farmer, but I'll leave that like that, and we'll have to come back for him. Ah, first trouble. Hi. Um... I'm going to put this down here for you. Will you change your mind? I don't need you to be a fisherman. I need you to be a farmer. Okay. So, worst case scenario. Any guys that are stuck as a non-farmer, like this is another fisherman. Um, I may have to... Hmm. I may have to replace. Which will not be good. Will not be fun. Getting these guys into place will be a challenge. Hi. Do you like a profession? Or you have one. Let's let's keep you that way. Uh find some more pumpkin pie. Thank you. That's good. And one last one. Would you like a profession? Ha! Ah, thank you. Alright. Oh, I don't have any wheat. Okay, go get some wheat. And we will... Okay, I get some wheat. We'll have to take care of a couple of these guys. And do I have yellow glass in here? I believe I have some extra yellow glass. Ah, here we go. We don't need that much. And... Hmm... Okay, well, I've got more wheat over here that's not a ton. I have a good wheat farm. Mostly because I don't really need wheat. So, worst case, I'll go over to VexFX's place. And he has an automated wheat farm that works pretty well. Yeah, I don't have any more wheat over here. I do not. Okay. Very good. Or not very good, but, you know, it's fine. I will toss stuff in here, and then let's go back home and see what we got. Actually, I think I'm going to call that an episode. Uh, then I'll go back home, we'll check on a few things there, uh, and we'll do that next episode. 
thanks for watching everybody this is theron it's been minecraft land party and i will see you next time bye